everyone so today I'm going to show you how to do these cutout nails they're also called negative space nails but I just call them cutout nails and these are a big trend especially for the summer before we get into the tutorial I just wanted to let you know what the orange design on my hand is because I know I'd get questions on that basically it's henna and henna is a type of plant and you can make a paste out of it and make a design out of it and it's a basically temporary body art and it's a cultural thing in the Middle East and Asia and I do henna a lot um, because I just like to and I have a lot of pictures on Instagram and stuff so if you want to see that you could check out my Instagram so moving on to the tutorial you're going to start off by applying a base coat to your nails next you're going to take your black striper and on your middle finger and your ring finger you are going to make geometrical triangles When you're done with that, you are going to take your dotting tool dipped in any color polish, I chose blue, and you are just going to color in one to two triangles. And then you're going to do the same with um, your second color, and I chose purple. Okay, once you're done with filling it in, you are going to take your black striper and you're going to outline around your whole entire nail. Now on your index finger, pinky, and thumb, you're going to take your blue polish and make a triangle on the base of your nails. You could also do this using tape to help you, but I found it so much easier just doing it freehand. And then you're going to take your purple polish and you're just going to drag it from each end of your nails towards the middle, giving it a jazzed up French manicure sort of look thing. And then you're going to take your black striper and you're just going to outline the, tr the triangle and the Frenchy, yeah. So once you're done with all of that, all you have to do is take your cotton swab dipped in acetone or nail polish remover and just clean up around your nails. And then you're just going to add a top coat and you're finished. So I hope you enjoyed learning how to do these nails. And don't forget to follow me on my social media. Thank you so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you in my next video.